Great day, beautiful people. Sammy Faraj here. Happy Sunday, happy Easter to those of you out there that are celebrating today uh, in the belief of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. I want to just send my wishes, my blessings to you guys. Enjoy your day, uh, take advantage of the day. But the purpose of this talk is one for me to put more positive energy out into the air. You know, I just wanted to do another raw talk on the Sunday morning. I did it last week, I'm gonna do it today. Uh, and I just wanna just talk on here for however long, send a, send a message to you guys um, that's gonna impact you, I know it will. So take it into consideration uh, and just go ahead and show this video some love, all right? So I'm on this walk and I was just, I was thinking, you know, I gotta do a video. So I was like, boom, I got the idea. So here we go. Uh, today, a lot of Christians are celebrating Easter. And like I said earlier, that's the day where Christians believe Jesus was resurrected, okay? So, but that was the rebirth, right? That was the rebirth. Came back stronger than ever, okay? So today, today you need to take into consideration all the blessings into your, in your life, the opportunity that's in front of you, whatever you're currently doing. You know, everybody's got different, different goals you know, and objectives in life, okay? So whatever yours is, focus on you. Stop worrying about other people, all right? Focus on yourself. What do you really want to get out of life? Because it's your experience, you know what I'm saying? It's your life, okay? And this today's the day for you to really think about that, all right? Just right now, you're probably around family, you know? Even if you're not, there's a lot of blessings around you, especially in the midst of this coronavirus. A lot of people are in a negative mind state. They're in suffering mind state, they're worrying whatever the case may be, but today a lot of people are happy, right? It's a holiday. Everybody's happy on a holiday, right? Whatever your whatever holiday you celebrate, you happy on that holiday, okay? And like I said, this talk is not a religious talk. Just to be transparent with you guys, this is me making a point, okay? I'm just speaking on what it is, all right? Uh, so, um, yes, being reborn, all right? Today's for you to figure out what you wanna do. You know what I'm saying? You probably spent a lot of time by yourself, you probably reflected a lot in this time, whether you got laid off, whether, you know, it, it affected a lot of people, okay? And if you got affected by it in however, you know, however way, it's okay. Today's the day to, to, to change your perspective on the situation and start moving yourself forward in this, in this time because it's all a mind state. You know what I'm saying? The media is gonna, the media is gonna control you. The media is gonna get you, you know, all that news, all that junk, all that talk that, half of the people don't know it's true, they they get consumed by that. And then they start worrying and then they start putting themselves in a bad situation. When today, it's the biggest blessing you have because all you have is right now, the breath you have right now, that opportunity you have right now, the present moment. So what are you gonna do to continue to improve yourself and better your life, you know what I'm saying? You you want a better life. Everybody wants a better life, right? And that's the and that's the things that people wanna, don't wanna talk about, right? It's all in, you know, internal peace, being being in tune with yourself, being self-aware, not being so external all the time or being in, easily influenced by what's being talked about and not getting to know yourself. And just and that, to me, that just being self-aware, right? You know, being self-aware, who, who, who are you? You know what I'm saying? Why do you do what you do? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, knowing, knowing who you are and not getting too influenced by the external things having having that self-discipline bro to be different you know to be the one percent to be the to the individual that's able to impact somebody and really have a bigger wanting more out of life and want and and you know working towards something bigger than himself right because at the end of the day it's bigger than you you know spend some jazz you know what i'm saying yeah drop a comment show us some love you know i'm just i'm just being real right now you know just, just spitting off the, off the dome. But it's all facts, you know. You gotta be grateful for the opportunity right now. Be grateful for your life right now. All right, because all you have is right now. It's a beautiful day. You know what I'm saying? On this walk, beautiful day. And they shut down all the parks, so you can only, you know, walk in the parks in your neighborhood. But. Be grateful for the opportunity. Today is the only day you have. Right now is the only now time you have. So it's just a reminder. Today's the day for you to commit and to be reborn, right? 
right? Kill the old you. Whoever the old you is. Because the person that's going to accomplish the things that you want is not the person that, it, that you are right now. You get what I'm saying? The person that you want to become is not the person you are now. But you cannot be both. You got to sacrifice what you want now for what you want most. So you got to kill what you have now. All right, kill kill yourself now, right? Whether it's you going to the gym and, and, and just killing yourself in the gym to kill your old self, right? And then you get stronger every single time. Same thing with life. You have to get uncomfortable every single day to grow. That's the formula. It's very simple, but you know, we're inconsistent with we're inconsistent with that process of getting uncomfortable. <clears throat> Not saying that we don't do it, but we're inconsistent. Kombucha. Hey, I shout out to kombuchas, man. They're fire. If you have never had one, it's like sp it's it's sparkling fermented tea. It's great probiotic for your gut. So you should definitely check them out. They're tasty. You can find them anywhere. All right. So be grateful and just really, you know, take a moment. Even if you take five minutes or whatever today, like especially today, there's a lot of it's a great energy. It's a beautiful day. It's a great energy day. You're probably feeling great today. You're feeling awesome today. Like take five, ten minutes, sit down and write, write some things that you're grateful for. Like what's going on in your life, the blessings in your life from from the socks you have to the to the bottle of water you sip out of to the food you eat. Uh, just like go in depth on the things that you have genuinely are grateful for that are that are really important in your life that you should take that you shouldn't take for granted right when I was hurt when I when, when my back was hurting I couldn't walk I couldn't do this right now what I'm doing right now you know what I'm saying I couldn't do this right now I couldn't walk you know I took I took walking for granted I took standing up for granted I took sleeping comfortably for granted you know what I'm saying now that I'm able to sleep comfortably and not be in pain, man, I'm grateful for that. You know what I'm saying? The, the ability to stand up this morning, I'm grateful for that. You know, the ability to walk right now, I'm grateful for that. The ability to go to the gym right now and be able to, you know, at least stretch and do the things that are the basics, I'm grateful for that. You know what I'm saying? Like, to be, that, to be able to move, and we take those things for granted, and you're worried about some external crazy shit that doesn't really have no sense of value to it when it comes to the bigger scheme of things right it's a balance this thing is a it's a balance you gotta you have to be balanced out with this thing you know this 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 thing of life this game of life you know you got to be aware and that's being self-aware you know going back to what i was saying but being grateful always having that sense of gratitude because it's anything can be taken from you you know it's, it's not it's not permanent that's that's the word it's not permanent you know and I think today's holiday represents that you gotta you gotta kill your old you and come back stronger whatever that is you know exactly what needs to be done I don't have to go in depth you know exactly what you need to be you know exactly what needs to be done do that thing get uncomfortable every day attacking that thing and you know exactly what your tasks are whatever you need to do and coming out coming out of that a better version of yourself because the higher earner, for example, if you're trying to earn a higher income, the higher earner, the higher earner you, you is not the person you are now. So what the, what are the things that need to change to become that higher earner? Because that's the only way that you're going to grow and accomplish whatever you want to accomplish. So happy holidays once again. I appreciate you guys. That's nine minutes. So I just wanted to drop some value. If you watch till the end, like you need to drop a comment. All right? If you watch till the end, you specifically need to drop a comment and even like put i watch till the end and put whatever emoji you want i watch till the end put whatever emoji you want i i want i want to shout you out i appreciate it thank you